The South African National Anthem signaling the start of the Global Icons Memorial Service at the Parliament Gardens in Ventuk. Namibia is not only a neighbor to South Africa, but the two countries share the same history. The same solidarity they shared during the War for Independence is once again shared as they mourn the passing of one of the African founding fathers. A beautifully decorated shrine for Madiba served as remembrance that he is no more and speakers after speakers paid their due respect to this symbol of forgiveness and democracy. The service was attended by Andres from all walks of life, but mostly the elder generation. Some sang songs of praises to the great men and wore t-shirts bearing his image. Different choirs also attended in good numbers to enlighten the celebration of Madiba's life and the legacy of those behind. Mandela was praised for his bravery in liberating South Africans and described as a man of a unique character who sacrificed the most productive years of his life for his people. One of them was the acting dean of the diplomatic corps, the Algerian ambassador to Namibia. He was a fundamental symbol of human rights, freedom, peace and justice, not only for the people of South Africa, but humanity humanity as, as a whole. The South African High Commissioner to Namibia on her part said, while the long walk to freedom for Mandela has ended, his people must be ready to continue where he left off as South Africa is still faced with many challenges. That of poverty, lack of skills, unemployment, and also curable diseases which are ravaging our communities. Winding up the program was the Speaker of the National Assembly who delivered a message on behalf of government. The leaders to celebrate the quality of life and achievements of Madiba. President Ifika Puyumpamba has declared a period of mourning in honor of the late South African former President Nelson Mandela and all flags will be flown at half-mast as from tomorrow until his state funeral on Sunday. He will be buried in his hometown of Kunu in the Eastern Cape. <laughs>